A woman is saved not by one, but by 13 of her fellow firefighters when she has a heart attack right in the middle of Pennsylvania Avenue. Can you believe it? Today we got a chance to meet her and she told the first responders and strangers they renewed her purpose in life. WUSA 9 reporter Mike Valerio has the story. I feel like that there's a purpose for me in life. So to me, I feel like that is an act of God. All the right people at the right time. And I was a block away from the hospital. Back where she recovered at GW Medical Center, firefighter Angelia Body says it's a miracle her first responder family was there to save her when she had a heart attack in the middle of rush hour. Oh, I see you. <laughs> I'm so glad you see you. Strangers also stepped in to help, like GW med student Brandon Glausman. I parked my bike, ran into the middle of the street. There wasn't traffic at that point, but I ran in the middle of the street. And then that, when I looked in the car, I saw there was an unconscious person in the car. Everyone who started CPR and kept her alive came together today, sharing stories of what happened that even she didn't know. I was amazed. I was amazed because I, don't, I can't remember anything that happened that day. 13 DC fire and EMS members just happened to be driving by, and some of them have been friends with Angelia for more than a decade. The fire department is like a, a big family, you know, so even though I've been on the job as long as I have and helped the multitude of people that I have, it was like they was waiting to do the will of God when they saved me. She thanked them all and is grateful that her purpose in life is reaffirmed. God bless you. Thank you, thank you. A second chance at life and a new calling to save others. In Washington, Mike Valerio, WUSA 9. And a lot of women don't know that uh, cardiovascular disease and heart attacks the leading cause of death for women. It's also worth noting she's been a DC firefighter for 20 years. She's still taking it easy, but expects to be back on the job in the next few weeks.